hey guys welcome to my channel so it's really easy to get lost on internet internet is huge so for example you just went to someone's twitter account and you just read some tweets and you felt like this is so beautiful this guy is angel i should follow him and you followed him but twitter never notified you about his video or you don't even have twitter app and what happened is you end up forgetting about that person and he's constantly uploading beautiful beautiful tweets but you're not looking at them and this is what happened you're just looking at youtube and you subscribe to a lot of beautiful youtubers okay why beautiful a lot of you know genius youtubers like books writer but you, what you're doing you're not watching their videos what okay you are watching my video at least but the, what i'm trying to say is instead youtube don't recommend their videos sometimes especially if you don't click on uh, that i button i don't understand like why there is a subscribe button and an i button okay bell button i guess what the fuck i totally forgot okay I, I i'm not using youtube guys i have a channel but i barely see the upload page only so yeah so what i'm trying to say is uh, you subscribe to some content creator but then you completely lose track of him and you don't even get realized like what things he's uploading so this happened with news too so you just want to know what is going on around the world in tech place so if you just want to know what's going on in tech uh, tech industry so but what happened is you don't see every news which comes you just see news which get mainstream which get more eyeballs more attention because uh, you are using an algorithm to consume content now this is where rss is beautiful because rss allows you to aggregate your entire internet so instead of having 10 apps on your phone which is constantly notifying you you can open that application whenever you want your rss feed reader and you can just see everything so it is neutral there is no algorithm so no matter who the person you subscribe you're always going to see everyone's content okay so in this video i'm going to show you my rss setup which is newsboard and i'm going to just show you how i set it up now one thing i want to make sure i remove a lot of rss links because of some private reasons so here whatever you are able to see is just uh, uh, something i i left okay so here this is my rss feed reader and the beautiful thing about this rss feed reader like for example if i just want to read this blog i just have to press o and what will happen is it will open it in cute browser but if you look close now okay so i it's not like i just waste all my time doing these kind of stuff uh but uh, when I set this thing up, I made sure to set it up beautifully. So uh, my background color, if you look close, is actually generated by Pywall. So I have my own CSS. So this is how I consume uh, any content. So I just open article. For example, this article, if I try to open it, now it's going to get open in cute browser in another tab. Okay, so browser return 69, I don't know. This is the first time it happened. It actually, this will only happen when I try to show something, which is kind of weird. So as you can see, so I'm using this tool called readability CLI to, you know, compress page into a really minimal page. So for example, TechCrunch article, if I try to, okay, TechCrunch actually provide you almost everything you need to read. But if I try to open a TechCrunch article from a news port, then let's see how it will look. Okay, it's it's looking really minimal, but I'm pretty sure that's it. Let's let's just open this article in uh, in my actual browser, TechCrunch article. So this is um, Firefox, my usual browser. Yeah, I think that's it. What the fuck, TechCrunch? Is this, you you call this a blog? It's nothing. It's it's like a. Okay, let's just close it. I don't know. I I have no clue about uh, these kind of things. I'm not a writer. Okay, so let's just try to watch some videos. So I have so many subscribers. So for example, this subscriber, let's just open some video. So all I have to do is press O and so as you can see, it's in my MPV. It's so beautiful. Like this is my usual day. Like every day I'm doing this thing. Every day I open news board, I read some article and especially watch videos. Okay, so if I have, if I just want to know what's going on on my 10 clinics user community, I can just see the post from here now i haven't set it up any way to open it i mean i can open it with my tedit so if i open it uh, like i can open it with my tedit but i don't want to open it on the video so let me close this by the way yeah 
so by the way i was trying to okay i don't know why but i decided like i will look for a job and so i also have a lot of job boards here uh, i don't see any i i the application process is so boring i give up okay so how this thing is set it up so let me close let me close this so it's pretty simple to set up news board uh, you just have to read the documentation this is what i did uh, so many programs all right so this is my news board so these two files is what you need so one is urls which is nothing but the rss links okay so this is just rss link and this is really clever i actually stole it from luke smith so what okay so what i did is here i have this heading section so in newsboard it actually treated as a rss feed uh, but uh, it doesn't give anything because it's a you know this not a link so it's just zero all right so what else i got i got this config now let me open this config it's interesting so i did some i looked into docs and i copy pasted this these lines here which is for the uh, pie wall if you try to use newsboard with the default pie wall color scheme it's going to look really horrible but i managed to get okay i'm going to give the link in the description of my feed i changed some key bindings according to my you know jk and all this thing i did this so this is nothing but just some highlight stuff it's really hard to explain you should just read I, oh god don't torture me but the main thing is this thing browser link handler so i have this script link handler so let me open link handler so what this script do is uh if i give this if i give any link it's going to just open it accordingly so if i give any youtube video it's going to open it uh, with mpv if i give any image it's going to it this never happened but i did it all right so i actually i have some torrents um, this thing like torrents rss feed too but i removed it so i don't want to show these kind of stuff on my channel so this is a css styles.css so what happened is in readability cli i totally forgot like readability where is readability cli so yeah link handler so what happened is if i open this script link handler link handler link handler so readability cli is actually um okay what it is it's okay it's readable so it's actually a program uh it's actually readable yeah it's not readable to cli or it is is it oh, no no it is readable to cli it's written in npm it's a program yeah i'm pretty sure it, either it's readable to cli or it's yeah it is readable to cli so it's going to output a html page and i'm using this style sheet here minus s config and then giving the url so if if it's a blog if it's anything else other than you know like it's going to just open it um set id browser so yeah it's going to open it with Qt browser so i'm using Qt browser for this thing uh, which is kind of weird but the reason i'm doing it is because i don't want bars so if i open any article like if i go and open any article i can open multiple articles and i hide the bar so in order to like how to hide bar so you just have to set a uh, status bar or status bar show and then you have to type never in mode or always so if i do always okay this is for status bar let me show you for tab tab start show yeah so switching if you're switching so mine is switching so if you're switching it will be visible if you have always on so it will be always on so this is uh, the status bar so yeah i love news board i read news daily you know i'm trying to improve my reading skills uh also I, I i would like to ask you to comment on my english because i'm trying really hard i'm even doing tongue twisters these days i'm watching a lot of english movies i'm i learned so many words i'm trying really hard because i don't want uh, just because of my bad english i don't want this channel to die you know i want to communicate well so if you have any suggestions or anything to say don't write good stuff like i'm not trying okay i'm not asking you okay one of my friends actually told me to you know have some feedback or some ideas all right so that's it it okay uh yeah that was my news board it's a really good tool it keeps your it's good for mental health i really believe like you should use news board it's it's really help mental health and uh, you know these days mental health is a big big word all right so thanks for watching this video